Yes, I'm construction foreman Dave. I'm firefighter Dave. I'm pilot Dave. I'm truck driver Dave. And I'm truck driver Becky. I'm engineer Dave. I'm deputy Dave. And I'm deputy Becky. Join us as we explore all sorts of fun stuff and get in all sorts of trouble. Live action video for kids. Get in on the action and collect the whole series. In There Goes an Airplane, we'll fly all kinds of airplanes. This is one of the biggest airplanes in the whole world. There goes a fire truck. We'll see what it takes to be a real firefighter. Firefighters have to be specially equipped in the clothes they wear as well in order to stay safe when fighting fires. There's nothing else like it in the whole world. So get in on the action now. <laughs> and there goes a bulldozer. We'll actually drive some of the biggest machines in the world. It's like a great big shark's jaw. What it does is it bites down on the rocks and then crunches them into smaller pieces so that they can be recycled. He told me not to touch one of these. I shouldn't have done that. And there goes a truck. We'll learn all about big rigs. The fuel goes into the engine. It explodes and drives the pistons up and down. Bang, 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 bang. Wait a minute. This is, you're not supposed to lift me. Wait, it's hooked on me. And there goes the train. It's all aboard for fun. As you can see, these engines are really big. All aboard. <laughs> and there goes a the police car. We'll learn all about police work and the neat equipment they use. So if you're ready, I'm ready. Let's go fly. Live action video. It's big, it's exciting, and it's lots of fun. Hey kids, if you like the action you just saw, you're going to want to collect the whole live action video series. Coming soon, there goes a spaceship, there goes a race car, there goes a boat, and lots more. 247, David, come in for a call. 247, David, that's us. See you next time. <laughs> for some fun with real animals. Real animals. It's time to spend a day with lions and other cats. Real animals. Did you know that tigers like to swim? Do you know why lions are called king of the beasts? Well, be smart and sing along with some cool cats. To sneak and peek without a sound. To creepy crop. Along the ground Never forget The golden rope To be cool, cool The cat is cool On a day with lions and other cats We even find out how to take care Of our little kitties at home Does she have any cavities? I think she's been brushing She looks pretty good She really gets around But when it's time to dine She gets home right on time She always bounces back Without a scratch, next Nine lives, she's got, got nine, nine lives. Make sure you join us for all of our real animal adventures, including, of course, Jorge! Sorry, we're flying. We'll touch the sky together, you and I. We're dreaming, believing. We'll leap so high together, you and I. Did you know that horses have frogs in their feet? Frog? This is a frog. You can find out all about taking care of horses and riding horses in a day with horses.
It's time to sing along and play along with Clip Clop the Horse. He'll show you all you need to know about horses. Climb aboard Scholastic's The Magic School Bus for even more wild rides. Now you can collect all the fun in Scholastic's The Magic School Bus video collection. Cool. With the Frizz, Arnold, Wanda, and the rest of the gang. Join them for all of their exciting action-packed adventures. Find out what happens when Arnold swallows the bus in The Magic School Bus for lunch. Check out what's making Ralphie sick in the magic school bus inside Ralphie. Wow! When the kids get trapped in a haunted house, they never know what the next sound is going to be in the magic school bus in the haunted house. Watch this! Experience the wonderful world of animal habitats in the magic school bus hops home. Make waves as the gang journeys to the ocean floor in the magic school bus gets eaten. This is so cool! Blast off on a field trip that's out of this world when the magic school bus gets lost in space. <laughs> Come along, class! Collect all of Scholastic's The Magic School Bus videos so they can become lasting additions to your video library. I'd say it's a perfect time for a field trip! They're apes, and wild chimps live in Africa. But we're lucky enough to get a closer view here at the zoo. Vicky takes care of this big chimp group. Hi, Vicky. Hi. You have the best job. It is. It's a wonderful job. Is that a mama and a baby? Um, yes. We have two, two families, 13 chimps all together. Now, what would chimps do in the wild? Well, they spend a lot of time looking for food, foraging, mm -hmm. they play, yeah. and they spend a lot of time in social behavior called grooming. Well, you know, I noticed that chimpanzees, they play, they fight, they lay around a lot, a lot like people. We're all called primates, and chimpanzees are more like humans than any other animal in the world. Chimps have eyes in front of their heads, just like us. Dogs, for example, have them more on the side of their face. They have the same number of teeth as we do. They have hands like ours. They can hold things like pencils. Chimps even have toenails. They play. Mamas take care of their babies. They show off and try to be boss. They know how to use tools to get food. And they even communicate with each other in their own language. <coughs> mm -hmm. 
Nan's younger sister Joanna right next to her and Nan's mother Bonnie right next to her. That's one family right there. Yoshi. Come on, Toto. There we go. This is our oldest male. He's 40 years old. No, oh, Judy O. That's it. They're all gone. All gone. <laughs> a lot like people. Big, hairy people, don't you think? Well, they are different in some ways, too. Daddy chimps aren't as big as most human men. Their feet aren't like ours. They're like another pair of hands. And chimps' arms are very, very long, longer than their legs. If you look at the way they walk, you will see they actually do a knuckle walk. They walk on the soles of their feet and the knuckles of their hands. So you see, they are like us in many ways and different in other ways. Now, have you ever heard that saying, monkey see, monkey do? Yes, I have. Monkey see, monkey do. They like to be like me and you. The great big hairy copycats. They like to eat and take short naps. When I see chimps inside a zoo, they love to play like me and you. They swing like Tarzan on a vine and climb all the trees that they can find. They mostly like to sleep and eat and ride on mama's back so neat. The males show off when they compete. They're noisy when they yak, yak, yak. Monkey see, monkey do. They like to be like me and you. They're great big hairy copycats who like to eat and take short naps. They use their feet like extra hands. They often knuckle walk, it's called. They smile and frown just like a man. They even sometimes talk a language all their own they share. It's taught by mamas to their young. They even brush their baby's hair by using their big fat thumb. Monkey see, monkey do. They like to be like me and you. They're great big hairy copycats who like to eat and take short naps. They clean and groom their little ones to be good little apes. But when they want to have some fun, they end up in the wrong place. They eat all sorts of figs and leaves and chew on fruity treats. They get a lot of cavities cause they never ever brush their teeth. Monkey see, monkey do. They like to be like me and you. They're great big hairy copycats who like to eat and take short naps. Their jaws are rather big to help them at meal time. They eat lots of meat just like a hairy pig who loves to eat and climb. And if you like banana breath, just hang around the chip. But don't pick up his appetite Or you'll end up even fatter than a big old blip Monkey see, monkey do They like to be like me and you They're great big hairy copycats Who like to eat and take short naps Monkey see, monkey do They like to be like me and you They're great big hairy copycats who like to eat and take short naps. Monkey see, monkey do. I just can't get enough of those amazing chimps. And I bet you can't either. So, I'd like you to meet my friend Ripley the chimpanzee and his substitute mom, 
Debbie. Hi, Debbie. Hi, Casey. I'm sure glad we get to introduce your friends to my friend, the chimp. I sure do like chimps. You know, me too, especially Ripley. How old is Ripley? He's four years old and he still has a lot of growing to do. Well, I think he still needs to wear diapers. He's not quite potty trained yet. No, I can see that. But you know, I heard he can do a lot of fun things. Do you think you could show us? Oh, sure. What do you think? Ripley, clap, 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 clap. Good boy, tongue, tongue. Good, breath break. Good, stand up. Good, jump, jump, jump. Good, turn around. Turn, Rip, turn, turn, turn. Good boy, come here. Good, give me a kiss. Oh, he's wonderful. You know, when we were at the zoo, the zookeeper told us that chimps were just like humans. How did you take care of Ripley when he was a little baby chimp? Well, actually, he slept in a basket right next to my bed so I can hear him cry because he would wake up and want his bottle. I would also have to change his diapers. Oh. Well, you know, we know that chimpanzees are not like monkeys because monkeys have tails. And let me take a look here. Mm -hmm. No tail in there. Nope. Ripley is an ape, and apes don't have tails. Well, darn. Because, you know, I had the perfect song for Ripley. It was called Monkey Shines. And I was wondering, do you think that Ripley would like it even though it's about monkeys and not chimpanzees? Well, let's see. Okay.
Ripley kisses. <laughs> it seems that Daddy and Ripley are friends. Are you ready for a little more adventure? Yeah. <sighs> Do you want to know about gorillas? Yeah. How about monkeys? Yeah. Well, about gorillas. She takes care of them here at the zoo. Hi, Jennifer. Hi, Casey. Hi, kids. These are Western lowland gorillas, and they come from the forests of West Africa. And these are the largest of the great apes. They are really beautiful. And you know, I was noticing their faces. They have the weirdest expressions. Were they happy or, or sad or excited? 
a lot of times they look sad. Um, they, they don't smile and, and their mouths kind of turn down in the corners. So a lot of times a gorilla at rest will look sad. But they really aren't. That's just a gorilla face. Do, the, do gorillas laugh? Actually, gorillas chuckle. It looks like these gorillas are a family, are they? Well, they're kind of an extended family. Gorillas don't live in mother, father, baby groups. They live with one male and several females and their offspring. What's going on over here with the big gorilla? Well, this seems to be the beginning of uh, Zombo and Jim's daily wrestling match. Now, Jim is? Jim is his son, <gasps> and they absolutely adore each other. And you can see this big, huge gorilla playing with his little boy. Oh, is he giving him a kiss? Well, it's a play bite. OK. Oh, look at him. He's nibbling on yes, his face. Uh -oh. Bite, bite, bite. Uh -oh. <laughs> They're just, that's And it's a all bite? in fun. When Zombo's walking around, since he's the biggest, is he kind of like the leader of the group? He's definitely the leader of the group. And all the animals in the exhibit know where he is at all times. He leads the group. He keeps them safe from danger. The younger they are, the more time they spend playing. The older they are, the more time they spend around just resting. Do you love gorillas? I love gorillas. Thank you so much for telling us all about gorillas, but I think it's time that we went to see some monkeys. Jennifer, can you point the way? Yeah, they're right over there. look like the monkeys I've seen in books. Yeah, these are called spider monkeys and they're from South and Central America. They call these spider monkeys because of their long arms and their long tail, they resemble the long legs of a spider. They can swing quickly from branch to branch. They even use their tail to hold on. They love to eat fruit. The baby's clinging to its mom and it will do so for about five or six months before starting to venture out on its own for short periods. Howler monkeys are known for their loud roars in the forest. They would rather yell than fight, so they yell to scare others away. This red howler monkey's mom didn't take very good care of him. That's why Jordan is in the baby nursery, where people can take care of him until he's old enough to go back out with the big kids. These are cute little monkeys. The small ones are called marmosets, and the larger ones are called sake monkeys. They live in South and Central America where the spider monkeys and howlers live. The thing that's most interesting about the marmosets is that the daddies take care of the babies. Soon after they're born, the babies crawl on the daddy's back and they usually go back to mom only when they want to eat. These families really take up for each other when there's danger around. In the sake monkeys, the boys have white fur on their faces and the girls have white stripes. These are called walkeries. They are also from South America and they're known for their bright red faces and the healthier they are the more red their faces we're headed back to african monkeys are you ready let's go these great jumpers are called colobus monkeys they spend their days leaping through the trees and munching on leaves baby colobus monkeys are pure white when they're born with little pink hands feet and faces the debrazaguinans have a long white beard and they have stripes that run along their legs. And last but not least, these great red apes are called orangutans. They live on two islands in Indonesia. Orangutan means wild man or person of the forest. This one looks like a wild man, all right. As you can see, monkeys, apes, and primates are a lot of fun. It's great seeing how they live and what they do all day. What do you guys think? I want to see them all again. You do? Let's see more monkeys and apes! You asked for it! Yay! Oh, yeah! <laughs> You're in great shape When you're in egg shape You're in great shape When you're in egg 
It's a jungle out there Every single day We've got to try to do our best In every single way We need to get enough rest And we go to sleep at night And respect our body And do what's right To stay in shape And grow big and strong Just like an ape We can't go wrong To stay in shape They smile and frown just like a man They even sometimes talk A language all their own they share It's taught by mamas to their young They even brush their baby's hair By using their big fat thumb Monkey see, monkey do 
They like to be like me and you. They're great big hairy copycats who like to eat and take short naps. <laughs>